First Wu has denied all accusations of sexual assault against minors that were made against him recently, but Du Mizu continues to speak out. Through a statement on his Weibo account, he stated that he never did anything of what these people are claiming and he will fully accept the punishments and accountabilities of his words. He said he didn't respond previously because he didn't want to interfere with the progress of the legal process, but he didn't expect that his silence would lead to more intense attacks from those who are spreading rumors. He has reached his limit. Du Mizu, the woman who is making the accusations against Chris Wu, shared an interview with the press about her experiences in dating Chris Wu, sharing details about their private lives and how she came to meet him while she was 17 years old. I'll leave the interview on the screen, pause to read the whole thing. To briefly sum it up, they are talking about her relationship with Chris, talking about how she met him and how she was not his fan when they first met. She talked about going to his house. She also talked about how she was forced to play games and no one talked to her about work. She said that at the point she wanted to leave but the manager didn't let her and even took her phone from her and said that if she didn't have fun, Chris would be angry and it would destroy her career of becoming an actress. She then continues, he said I left for too long so I had to drink two glasses of cocktails. I was too scared to fight back and lost consciousness shortly after. When I woke up I was on Chris's bed. I couldn't think straight. I only came to believe what happened after staring at the ceiling and spacing out for a while. Chris was beside me and hadn't woken up yet. I didn't even know how to be angry at that time. I just didn't know what to do. She goes into more details about their relationship and the people she met and what they do together. They end the interview with the question what was the biggest takeaway? away from dating Chris. Her answer being the biggest takeaway is that I don't want to be in a relationship ever again. Wow, that's a heavy topic to cover. Right now while I'm editing, that's all the information that I have, but you guys know that more is bound to come out. So let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about the situation. I'll see you guys in the next video. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!